A Facebook post over the weekend claimed a child got sick after a day at Rigby's Waterworld. Rigby's quickly responded, saying it wasn't true. It all started with this post where a mom claimed her son got a rash, strep throat, and bacterial infection just days after going to the park. We wanted to know if the illness was linked to the water park. To verify, Kayla Solomon spoke to Michael Hawkinson from the North Central Health District and Rigby's general manager, Steve Brown, to sort out fact from fiction. There was uh, symptoms of strep throat, rash, things like that. And we felt pretty strongly that it wasn't something that would result from being at the water park. Steve Brown says he and the rest of the Rigby staff first saw the Facebook post on Saturday and immediately took action with a response. So we responded with, a, with a, just a statement to say that, you know, we, we monitor our pools daily. Uh, we monitor our pools every two hours. We check them manually every two hours. We have state-of-the-art filtration systems. But that response did not stop people from sharing the original post and prompted a few more accusations. Here, they're false statements that are being, being shared by everybody. And unfortunately, it, it hurts business. It gives us a bad reputation, and, and uh, we want to try to keep that from happening as much as we can. Michael Hawkinson with the North Central Health District also saw the initial post. To start off any investigation, we do need um, some sort of claim that can be backed up and verified. So we asked, are there any illnesses directly linked to Rigby's Waterworld? As of this point in time, we still have not heard back from any people that we directly reached out to on Facebook uh, involved in the posting. We have not received any official complaints uh, via our environmental health form. And we verified there are currently not any illnesses linked to Rigby's. We've not launched an investigation just because we have no um, substantiated claim to actually look into. Rigby says the pools are safe and being doubled and triple checked daily. In Warner Robins, Kayla Solomon, 13 WMAZ News. Rigby's and the Health District have both tried reaching out to the woman who made the original post and have yet to hear back. If you have something you'd like us to verify, email us at news at 13wmaz.com or send us a message on Facebook.